All right, we're gonna go give uh, Gail Helms a call from Pre Pets for People. She always has the cutest little pups to be able to introduce us to that are up and available for adoption. Let's get her uh, here answering the call. All right, good afternoon, Gail. Oh my gosh, so sweet. Who is this friend? This girl's name is Angel, and she's two years old, and she is a Blue Healer and Australian Shepherd mix. She was found as a stray and brought to the shelter, so not much is known about her. Seems like just with her behavior, she might have been abused. She's uh, kind of cowers down, and right now it appears that she likes women. It's going to take a little while for her to warm up to a man. She weighs about 45 or 50 pounds. She's totally vetted. So she needs somebody with a gentle hand, somebody who's really gonna show her lots of love, but also some patience and getting her to feel comfortable around her new owner. That's all it takes is a little loving hand and patience. Oh, look at those ears perk up. Oh, sweet girl. I know. I know, and a blue humor don't... mix. Well, I don't know how people can be so cruel and so inhumane to want a, to abuse a helpless animal, or kids for that matter. Right, but anyway, absolutely. I mean, we're, here these, we're here for these dogs and these cats, and so it's just so sad, but we give them lots of TLC. Yes. Volunteers do as well. Of course. So she's been very well behaved in here, and um, I think she would love to have a big old sofa or a bed that she could lay on. She's really very gentle and very laid back. But we do know that she likes other dogs. Yeah. Don't know cats. But when we take her down to the dog park, she kind of takes on a different persona and she's really a lot more <laughs> active and playful. So right now she's playing her poor pitiful me. Oh, playing a so little hard to home. get. That's she okay, wants though. to have a home. Absolutely, and who wouldn't, you know? And I think it's always, um, incredible the bounce back that that dogs can have after um you know the the ability to be able to show loyalty when none has been given to them previously um and it's it's such a good aspect towards moving forward to being able to integrate into you know a family that is ready for the responsibility but also just ready for unending love so gail if somebody is out there is watching this sweet girl and says yep that's my girl how can they make her a part of their family that was such a good point you made, Devin. They can call or they can actually go online to petsforpeople.org and click on that adoption application. You know, we're very particular about these dogs and who they get to go home with. We want to see what kind of a pet owner you are. So we'll take a look at that application. If we think she's going to be a good fit, we'll call you, make an appointment. If you have other dogs, if you have children, bring them. Let's see if it's going to be a good fit. Um, and then our adoption fee is 175 and that's total. Um, but we're just looking for a home for Angel. So please consider her. She needs a home and somebody to love her. Listen, um, as the we were just watching the cartoon Bluey, and that's hugely popular now, and she looks a whole lot like one of their characters. So I'm thinking that's in her favor. I'm thinking well, there's I somebody out there that says, yep, that's our girl. I hope you're right. We'll keep our fingers crossed and say a little prayer for Angel. Absolutely. All right. Well, we will talk to you again soon, Gail. Thank you, Debbie. Absolutely. So again, if you uh, want to make Angel a part of your home, you can head to petsforpeople.org. Um, there'll be a whole host of really really adorable and almost irresistible pets out there, including Gail's, uh, Gail, including uh, Angel's photo that you can click on, see her information, be able to fill out that form uh, to get the process started.